Hi, in this video, I will show you how to integrate the possibility to collect your data with your Elementor form and send it to your MailJet contact list. For this tutorial, we need a plugin. This plugin is MailJet integration for Elementor form. You have the this you have the link in the description below. So when you activate it, you need to go first to the settings of your WordPress, then you can find a new submenu called Mailjet API. In this menu, you will find two fields. In these two fields, you need to first paste the API key and the API secret. You can find it on your Mailjet account. Here on the menu, you can find API, and right here, you can find your API key and your secret key. Simply copy and then paste it in the two fields. After that, save the setting. Okay, now I will go to my website and I will create right here in the footer a new Elementor form with the Elementor form widget. So I go to the template of Elementor, I go to the footer and i will edit it so yeah in my footer i will create a new section i will paste uh sorry i will put a title subscribe to our newsletter okay uh, i will search for form and yeah i will drag the form of Elementor. So in my case, I just need to collect the email of my customer. So I will design it like that, the button. Okay. It should be good like that, yeah. I will reduce the container. Okay. I will center it. I don't need the label, okay. I will still the button. Okay, would be good like that. Now, we need to collect the data. So here, I will just add MailJet. And right here, we have the contact list ID. So here, you need to paste the contact list ID of where you want to send the data you will collect from the Elementor form. So you can find it on your contact list on Mailjet. Right here, I've got the list e-commerce users. And here I can see the ID. I copy and I will paste it. Okay, so now we, we will map the field. So I just need to collect the email field. So here, I will go here and in advanced, I can see the ID. So in my case, the email ID the email field ID is email. So maybe you can have a different ID. So in your case, you just have to copy and paste here. Okay, so now we're okay. I will just add some space. Okay, I publish it and I go on my website. Okay, perfect. So now on my e-commerce user, I got zero subscriber. So I will add a new email contact at test that here I will send it. Okay. So now if I go to my jet, okay, great. I've got one subscriber. So if I go into the list, I can see my new subscriber. So yeah, thanks to this plugin. Now you can easily integrate in a few minutes your Mayjet list to your Elementor form very easily. If you have any question, you can put it in the comment below the video.